I'm Bryson Port, and this is Hack the Plant. For today's episode, I'm joined by Ariel Stern, formerly an engineer in the Israeli Ministry of Defense and a civil infrastructure project manager, now currently the CEO of IACA, which offers remote monitoring for industrial Internet of Things. Ariel has a forward-looking approach to creating resilience in critical infrastructure, anticipating that we are entering a new era where hard infrastructure has machine learning capabilities. We are uh, in the beginning of a new revolution, the 4.0 revolution, the fourth industrial revolution that affects everything. Uh, as you mentioned, the three previous revolutions brought many things to life, but now everything began to be interconnected. And I think this is the biggest revolution about interconnecting all the different assets out there to one big network for decision making, for better operation. This is, I think, the meaning of the fourth revolution. But it goes beyond interconnection. We're looking at where our devices can start to become autonomous, where industrial cyber can begin to make its own decisions and react to what we see in the environment. So yes, so interconnection is the first part. And by interconnecting, you have like the ability to make better decision through awareness that devices or the assets start to understand or understanding is like there is a big difference between machines and humanity, right? But almost understand what is going on and you can program them or define set of rules for them to be better reactive to the environment. So yes, interconnection is the beginning, then you get into a much more interoperable and awareness mode. Might sound like science fiction. But the technology that can create resilient infrastructure for tomorrow is almost here today. IoT data creation, management, and analysis to advanced artificial intelligence pattern recognition and prediction. The infrastructure space at its majority is still in the stage of creating the data, meaning you need to have a systematic manner to collect the data or create and collect the data and then manage it before a, a big deployment of AI tools and machine learning tools are utilized. And we are not there yet in the majority of the utilities. Meaning there are some um, outliers out there that are dramatically better than the others, but the majority of the utilities in the remote assets can dramatically improve the way they collect and manage data. So the algorithm stage is still in its infancy, meaning we are not at the very big and complicated area yet in this space. Probably five to 10 years into the future uh, is the bigger part around those areas. How can technology make our critical infrastructure more resilient? How does AI fit in? We explore this and more in this episode. Thank you for listening to Hack the Plant a podcast of the R Street Institute and ICS Village Nonprofit. Subscribe to the podcast and share it with your friends. Even better, rate and review us on Apple Podcasts so we can reach even more listeners. Tell us what you thought about it and who we should interview next by finding us on Twitter at RSI or at ICS underscore village. Finally, if you want to know more about R Street or ICS Village, visit rstreet.org or icsvillage.com. I'm your host, Bryson Borg. Thank you to executive producer Tyler Lowe of Fado Creative, creative producer William Gray, and editor Dominic Sterrett of Sterrett Production.